When you design a new kitchen or renovate an existing one, the best part about the project is putting in the final touches. Here in Dresden, Ontario, we set out to help local builder Dave Depensier plan and design a perfect kitchen for this 1,400 square foot home. This project was a new build, so we started with choosing the layout. And we went with an L-shaped layout with a freestanding island. Next, we worked with Home Hardware Building Center to create the kitchen design. We planned the cabinetry and appliances and where they made the most functional sense. For the lighting, we used all LEDs, including the pot lights, which we spaced according to the kitchen layout, some pendant lighting over the island, and we used some LED strip lighting for under cabinet lighting that actually comes in multicolors. Rega wasn't really fond of my multicolored idea, but I knew you loved it. I went to Home Hardware to select the right beauty tone paints for the job. We paint the walls with Beauty Tone's Worn Cedar, which coordinates beautifully with the cabinets. On the island, we used Lucky Day Green, which was the perfect punch of color and helped define the island as a piece of furniture. One of the features in this kitchen that I really like is the flooring. It's actually a rustic oak laminate that's very durable and 100% Canadian made. And it actually looks like it's real hardwood. The cabinetry is owner's choice line in the Lindsay profile, which gives the kitchen nice, clean, simple lines. Although I love open shelving in the magazines and it's a really trendy thing right now, I do appreciate for real life closed cabinetry. And in this case, this kitchen is open to the dining room and the living room, so you want to keep clutter at bay and this was the best solution. I had on my wish list a coffee station that would make entertaining guests easier and a pull-out microwave that could live behind closed doors. In order to do this, our licensed electrician was able to install specialized wiring so when the doors close, the power turns off. I really love the coffee station. It was an idea that I kind of had that I thought would be a unique thing and with Reiko's help, it turned out to be fantastic. See? Team effort, Reiko. That's right. The island was a joint collaboration. It's a very simple project. Taking four upper cabinets and mounting them together and then getting legs on the sides gives it a total different look than the average island that you see all the time. So it makes it unique as well. The countertop is a white quartz by Wilson Arts, which gives the kitchen a bright marble look. The backsplash is a Sia white subway tile. The irregular tiles give an old world hand pressed look with the wavy texture reflecting the light beautifully. These GE stainless steel appliances complete the kitchen. They add modern sophistication and energy efficiency. One of my favorite parts of the kitchen is the apron front sink. It's stainless steel, it has bottom grids, and it's a real focal point. And the gooseneck faucet is great looking and very functional. Another thing that I love about the kitchen is that we were able to put in a window. Now initially the blueprints had the sink in the island and we decided to put it along the wall. Now it's a beautiful spot to grow some herbs and get all of this natural light. I love it. No matter how much space you have, there are always ways to create openness and maximize functionality. We didn't just stop at the kitchen design and where the cabinets should go. We maximized every inch of those cabinets to give this homeowner smart storage. We added different levels of pullout shelving in the island. Under a coffee station, these drawers have a top level pullout for extra coffee pods or storing your lids. Under the sink, we made space for the garbage, recycling, and cleaners. These shelves can hold up to 100 pounds, so storage is completely at your discretion. This is my favorite cabinet. Look at this. Ooh. Spice display, great organization for all those pans that just move around all the time. Love this. Dave, our kitchen project is finally done. You know what? Great job. Thank you so much for all the help and it's turned out amazing. It's been a pleasure working with you. Next time. Would you like a pair? <laughs> Oops! Oh. <laughs>